Um, the first two things that come to mind are ideas that are not originally mine, but I want to say them here because I think they're, they're great. Um, the first is that capitalism only operates um, based on the mere fact that there are people that um, help run it and that make it possible um, and are kind of enslaved to it, uh, depend on it. Um, and are made unfree by it that don't also profit from the fruits of what it produces. So that's the first idea. What that means is, is that um, after capitalism, if we move in a good way, then we'll progress towards liberation. It has to. Because if it's deconstructed, then um, you take out the inherent form of inequality. Um, what comes after you know, it's that's with the absence of capitalism. With the implementation of another system, I don't know what kind of inequalities might appear. It could be anything. But my hope is that it'll be um, something that um, is maintains that liberation um, for all of us. Um, yeah, I think um, with the absence of capitalism, we can move forward for economic justice. Um, which is tied to so many other forms of um, total liberation. Um, yeah. And the second idea is that it's possible. Okay.